There is a nation who claims greatness. They claim to be descended from an ancient empire, one that spanned the seas and lands, its legions roaming from desert sands to frozen wastes. But now they are but a shadow of what they once were, and their ideas of greatness no longer live up to their reality. So it is time for us, the Turks, to march on this false empire and show them true greatness, something they have not seen for generations. To war then, and to battle, for the Turks, for Islam, and for the idea of glory and greatness, it is time to claim those words as our own. Hi guys, welcome back. I am Red Zed, and today we are on our second day of our 12 battles of Christmas. And we all know the setup, we all know the scenario after that introduction. The Turks are marching on Byzantium. And it is time to bring the wrath of the Turks upon the false people who claim to be the descendants of Rome. We are truly the greatest empire of these lands, and we will not let these false Romans dictate terms anymore. Uh, and we have our two trebuchets. We have a lot of horse archers, so we have Sipahis and Turkish horse archers. We also have some Nafatun, some Greek fire ready to rain down upon the enemy, as well as our Saracen militia and our Hashishim and Armenian cavalry, an Armenian detachment as part of this Turkish incursion into Byzantine lands. Without further ado, guys, let's get this battle started, and let's get going. So, Hashishim, we're going to try and take the canyon, the glorious canyon that they have decided to protect. They have a lot of cavalry uh, and a lot of men, as you can see, the, uh, the Byzantines. Very, very heavily armoured army, and that is our hope that our horse archers can one day break through their armour and we will win and be victorious. Now, in terms of these guys, I'm going to try and wait for our trap to spring. We're going to bring our guys forward a little bit. We don't have much infantry like we spoke about, uh, but we do have some very, very interesting troops. So... We really do rely on our cavalry to do most of the damage here. Uh, and you can see the heavily armoured Varengian guard marching upon us, as well as the Byzantine spearmen. They have dismounted Byzantine lancers as well, and Latincon. So very, very uh, strong army that they have going on here. These guys are all firing now, and ideally I would like them to fire upon the Byzantine cavalry. We need to get rid of that cavalry ASAP. Um, who are they firing upon? Because it doesn't look like they're doing any damage. Maybe these dis dismounted Byzantine lancers. Let's uh, fire upon the Byzantine lancers. Let's actually come across a little bit. Uh, run, my friends. Run. Uh, and hopefully they will be in range of our trebuchets soon. But it's quite a while down there that they will go. They will need to go. In fact, we're going to have to take two of these guys up to the north. And we're going to bring our cavalry up here as well uh, to try and defend We'll get the rest of you boys over here. And where are our Naftune throwers? Are you still firing, my friends? You are. Oh, we're doing some serious damage to that cavalry, as we can see. Very nice. Let's, uh, yeah, fire upon them, my friends. Fire upon them. Uh, the Naftune throwers, I'm thinking, might use them up here. Might be a bit of a silly move, but we're going to try and use them. Can our trebuchets fire yet? They should be on fire at will. Get you on fire and shot as well. And hopefully they do some serious damage to our enemies. The canyon is our friend. The canyon is our friend, isn't it? Ah. We are damaging that cavalry quite a bit. The Byzantine Lancers has routed. That is excellent for us. We just need to kind of block off this region. Block off this area with our Turkish boyos. So let's go. Ah, the trebuchets are firing, my friends. The trebuchets, the trap has been sprung. The canyon will be the killing fields of these men. How far ahead can you fire? It's not very far, is it? But you're going to do some serious damage. Uh, let's uh, 
Fire at the cataphracts now. Look at those boys. Heavy, heavy armor. Come on. We know you can fire soon. You are starting to fire already. We have nothing. Oh, no. Oh, God. The trebuchets. Damaging our own men. I don't think. Have you fired yet? They've not even fired. Run away, then. Run away. You will defend the trebuchets, my friends. Get away. And we're going to have to get our horse archers out of there as well. Let's come round the side if we can. It's uh, starting to lag a little bit. I don't know why. It's only med 2. It shouldn't lag. Get these guys. Go, go, go. Byz Byzantine lancers. We must fight them. We'll charge them in the rear. What are they? Byzantine spearmen. Vrengian guard are going to do a decent job against us. Oh my god. The trebuchet. No. The trebuchet is destroying our own men. What a nightmare. Nightmare scenario. And it's actually not hit any of those guys yet. Uh, Hashishin should be good. Yep. Yeah, got into there. And where is our general going? I right, charge into the back of the Byzantine lancers. But they are flooding through. They are flooding through. Uh, where is the rest of our horsemen? These ones. Let's get them forward. They need to fire down upon the enemy. You guys run. Let's get across here. They are flooding through. Coming to fire at our, our men. If we killed these guys, we have. Right. Round this side now, boys. The general is fleeing. Fantastic. We do have so many horse archers left that even if we do start to rout everywhere, I think we'll be okay. Come on, boys. Stay strong. Stay strong. Our trebuchets are getting destroyed. Come on, horse archers. We need you in this moment. We need you. Where are you? I want you to uh, come here if you can. They're very obsessed with the trebuchets, aren't they? Dismounted Latinkon. Right, you need to get back around there. Come on, let's go, boys. Let's go. Get out. It is epic playing these old games, guys. Like, I I know many people don't play these anymore, but I just wanted to showcase them and, like, how good they can be. Especially around Christmas when you've got lots of time to play games, guys. Maybe, maybe play some of these older games just for that nostalgia, just for that fun uh, that they bring. Uh, compared to the seriousness of a lot of the uh, newer sort of games. Uh, we've broken those guys as well. All right, you guys need to fight them. Then we're going to charge them. And then you're going to come and charge them as well. We have so many horse archers. I don't think... And I think the horse archers will do fantastically well. Like we just need to keep them plugging away. If we get them over here, they should be able to fire on a lot of these dismounted Byzantine lancers. It's a bit of a mess, this battle so far. You can see the hordes of the enemy just flowing through. My Naftoon have pretty much done nothing. They haven't been able to do anything. These guys are wavering. If we could just get one little charge in there. My Armenian cavalry has done really, really well. That wasn't really a charge, I'm not going to lie. But let's, uh, let's get these guys out as well. And we'll go for one more charge. And that should hopefully break them. Now, horse archers. Yeah, the Sapahis. If we just pause for a second. Their defense and their melee attack is really good as well. So they should be fine in melee. Once they've got rid of all their ammo, that is when we're going to start charging these men. Let's get these guys. And you guys, let's get you here. And then you can charge. Uh, just charge. Just charge. It'll be fine. Rally the boys as well. Yes, come on the charge. We know the charges in med 2 are so powerful. Why did you stop before the charge, though? Okay, that's broken them. Straight through. Okay, Varengian guard and stuff. That's going to be a different challenge. We're going to have to wait for a little bit. Um, now the horse archers. These guys. I'm going to fight those dismounted Byzantine lancers. In fact, don't. We need to charge them, really. So let's get back. Uh, same with you. You two. Yeah, looks like we are losing. Looks like we are going to lose. 
There's just too many of the troops, and they're so heavily armored. <laughs> and again, I'm not hugely experienced on Med 2. I know that sounds stupid as someone who's played so much Rome 1. But even when Med 2 came out, I was playing Rome 1 still, so... Um, yeah. <laughs> okay, we have these guys have come back. Let's go fight the dismounted Latinkan. These guys have come back as well. Uh, where are you? Yeah, you're so far away. Only half the enemy force remains. Right, boys, let's get in there. Charge the dismounted. They're already shaken. This horde of cavalry might bring us round. Might save us, but I doubt it. I doubt it. I don't think we're going to quite have enough. They have so much infantry. I mean, they are spread out, though. That's one good thing. No, our general has died. That is really not going to help us. No. Please. Please. Where's the Armenian boyos? There they are. Let's go for... I mean, the Vrengian guard are a good target, even though they're so heavily armored. Right, down the hill, boys. Into this. I know the Byzantine lancers are spearmen, but we have nothing. Oh, wait, no. Oh, they're routing already. Good. Right, this is this is going to be close, in fact. Only half our force we charged the Varengian guard. Didn't work. These guys need to come back. Come on, they're shaken. Let's get them. I mean, it's a lot of cavalry, this. It's a lot of cavalry that we have left, and cavalry so powerful. Um, let's split our boys into two groups. Let's come around this way now. Uh, you guys go that way. Byzantine spearmen is never the greatest people to charge into. But it'll be fine. <laughs> There's not much else we can do right now. Apart from just charge our cavalry into them. Like crazy bastards. I mean, they've got their back turned. Victory is a distinct possibility. No! I mean, we've killed more than them. It's just, of course, like, most of our troops are cavalry, so they don't die so quickly. These guys are running away. That's embarrassing. They're shaken. Oh, we just can't get the charges off with this map. No, they are running too. All our cavalry is gone. All our cavalry has gone. No. Ah, god damn it, bro. It's not going to help just charging in there for no reason. Uh, where are you? Yeah, you're there. Yeah, everyone routes. <laughs> ah, we have lost against the Byzantines. We have lost against the Byzantines. Oh, no. Looks like they do claim Rome after all. As they <laughs> claim to be the heirs of Rome. Oh, well. Well, anyway. I mean, it was fun. It was a fun battle. And I hope you enjoyed... hope you're enjoying, like, the intros and the stories behind these battles. Uh, they're always fun for me to do. Um, and they do take a lot of work. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. As long as you guys are enjoying it, that's all that matters. Oh, God damn it, bro. Brutal battle, this one. Brutal battle. Yeah, everyone is routing. That is us. That is us done. We killed actually more, like, percentage-wise than them. Uh, and probably more in raw numbers, honestly. Because we started with not that many men. Our trap didn't work either. We... we <laughs> Our trebuchets just ended up killing, like, more of, like, literally all our men. So, yeah, we lost a lot less than them. But if you have a look at that, battle statistics. Uh, who did well? Hashishim, 116 there. 80 for the Armenian cavalry. It's not even that much, really. Um, yeah, the horse arch is not doing too well. I mean, they did decently. Naftun did terrible. I don't know why I brought those guys. Uh, but, yeah. Well, that was fine. But anyway, guys, if this has brought you a little bit of extra uh, Christmas cheer, please do like, comment, and subscribe. It really does help the channel out. Keep commenting down below your suggestions for who you think are going to be the special guests and what sort of mods we're going to be playing and what games we're going to be playing as well. Uh, but anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, Merry Christmas, have a great Christmas, and I will see you all again on the next video.